By the calm river in their town, Alec sat on a big rock. The water flowed gently, and the sun warmed their face. It was a peaceful place to think. Today, Alex had a question in their mind, like a puzzle. How could we differentiate between real friends from fake ones? A wise old Zen master, Master Chen noticed Alex's contemplation. Master Chen sat beside Alex and said, I see you have something important on your mind, my child. Alex nodded. Yes, Master Chen. I want to know how to differentiate between real friends from fake ones. Can you help me understand? Master Chen smiled and began to share a differences about real friends and fake friends, right there by the calm river. 1. Real friends find time, fake friends provide excuses. This doesn't mean that they have to talk or hang out with you every single time you want to. It simply means that during moments it matters the most, real friends will do everything they can to make time for you or create opportunities just to spend quality time with you. On the other hand, fake friends will be ready with a long list of excuses to dodge any hardship or bad times you may be facing and will only resurface when things get steady again. 2. You feel it in your gut. Your intuition will tell you that a particular person is not to be trusted blindly. If you have a weird feeling when you are talking to a person claiming to be your best friend, there is a good reason your guard is up. Don't dare ignore it, because it will be right 99% of the time. If you have a feeling someone is not genuine, there is a high chance your instincts may be right. 3. Real friends will support your ideas, fake friends will mock them. Sometimes, we have unconventional ideas that may get us into trouble or help us discover ourselves, and most often, it takes one real friend to help you sort things out. They will not only help you get to know yourself better but also bring out the best in you, the parts you may not have known existed, whereas fake friends won't even care to take the challenge. They will immediately dismiss your idea as crazy and not worth the effort. 4. Fake friends will treat you differently around different people. They may be super sweet to you when you are alone together, but the moment someone else joins in, they will act completely different. That is a major red flag. Fake friends will only be nice to you when they need something. 5. Real friends will accept your faults, fake friends will leave because of them. People are not perfect, but our imperfections are what make us unique. Real friends acknowledge that fact, and they effortlessly accept you for who you are. You may disagree on things, but they are there for you, no matter what. On the other hand, fake friends won't be patient enough to deal with your faults and will try to leave as soon as they find themselves in unfavorable situations. 6. Fake friends will talk trash behind your back. Okay, a lot of people may tend to do this. If we are angry at our friend, we may badmouth them to another friend. That's understandable. But if a friend is talking trash about you with the intention of spreading rumors or trying to change people's perception about you, buddy, that's not your friend. If you care about a person, you will never try to hurt their reputation. 7. Fake friends will be intensely jealous of your accomplishments. Unless it benefits them, of course. But if you get a new job with more pay than them, they are going to be snarky about it. Sure, they will celebrate with you, only if you are paying. However, they are not really happy with your accomplishments. If you are struggling to figure out the difference between real friends and fake friends, remember that a true friend will be genuinely happy to see you succeed and flourish at all times. 8. Real friends will keep your secrets. If you tell your friend a secret, the point is that they don't share it with other people behind your back. A fake friend will use that secret for gain. Remember, betrayal of your secrets is a sign of a fake friend. A real friend would respect that you shared something so personal with them and keep their mouth shut. Master Chen's words resonated deeply with Alex. They looked at the river, feeling a sense of peace. Before parting, they turned to Master Chen and said, thank you for your guidance. 
I promise to be a real friend to those who need one. With a smile, they walked away, ready to embrace true friendships. If you learned something from this story, do like, subscribe and comment on the video.